This is uh, the prophet Ezekiel chapter 38 verse 1. The word of the Lord Yahweh came unto me saying, Ezekiel 38 verse 2, and it reads, Son of man, set thy face against Gog and the Magog and the chief prince of Meshach and Tubal, prophesy against it. Ezekiel 38 verse 3. And thus saith the Lord Yahweh, Behold, I am against thee, O Gog, and the chief prince of Meshach and Tubal. The prophet Ezekiel 38 verse 4. And I will turn thee back and put husks into thy jaws, and I will bring thee forth from all thy army, horse and horsemen, all of them clover, all sorts of armor, even in great company, and bucklers, and shields, and all them him and swords. And this is out of the prophet Isaiah 13, verse 17. Behold, I will stir up the meads against them, which shall not regard silver, and as for gold, they shall not light in it. And this is out of the prophet Joel 3 and verse 9. Proclaim ye this amongst the Gentiles, prepare war, wake up the mighty men, let all the men of war draw near, and let them come up. The prophet Joel 3 and verse 10. Beat your plowshares and the swords and pony hooks into spears, and let the weak say I'm scrum. And this is the book of Ecclesiasticus. 3 and verse 8, and it reads, In a time of love, in a time of H-A-T-E, in a time of war, in a time of peace. Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to, to Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai Ba'ashem, Akar Kadash. Shalom to the uh, elders while I give my aqua and I say Shalom. And this is a uh, recent sit this is a recent news article, but it's sit down lesson as of May the uh, 26, 2024 from RT.com and it reads US crack on Russia targets will be start of World War, according to Matt Medvedev. It says the ex president Warren comes out the poll and said Washington would hit uh, Russia targets if Moscow were to use nukes in Ukraine. It says any U.S. attack on Russia targets in Ukraine will automatically trigger a world war. Former Russian President Dmitry Medvedev has warned the officials who currently serve as a deputy chair of Russian Security Council made remarks after published foreign minister Rad Radoslav uh, Shakarovsky, if I pronounce his name right, claim Washington has threatened to conduct such a strike should Russia use nuclear weapons in Ukraine. In a post on X, which is formerly known Twitter, on Sunday, Medvedev suggests that uh, Shirovsky, uh apparently has decided to scare his masters. He noted that Washington, unlike Warsaw, has so far refrained from making any such threats publicly because they are more cautious than the Poles. Americans hitting hard targets means starting a world war, and a foreign minister, even of a country like Poland, should understand that Medvedev added. The former Russian president also cited remarks made by the pup, pup, uh, Polish president last month when he said his country will be willing to host U.S. nuclear weapons if offered such a opportunity under NATO sharing mechanism. Medvedev warned that in the case of a nuclear confrontation, Warsaw won't be left out and surely get this share of radioactive ash asking if this is the outcome of the Polish leadership is really wants. On Saturday, in an interview with the uh, Guardian newspaper, Sher uh, Sharovsky uh, expressed skepti skepticism regarding a hypothetical Russian nuclear strike in Ukraine. The Americans have told Russians that if you explode a nuke, even if it doesn't kill anybody, we will hit all your targets position in Ukraine with conventional weapons and we will destroy all of them he claimed, describing the presuming warning as a credible threat the Polish diplomatic alleged that China, India also have warned Russia against a nuclear escalation it says the minister also suggested that Ukraine's uh, western backers should allow Kavit to use their weapons to scrape military targets on a Russian territory as a part of not using nuclear weapons. Moscow does not limit itself much 
according to Swarovski, the EU should not be afraid to escalate the situation and should not impose limit on itself regarding the Ukraine conflict so that Moscow is left guessing of what the next step will be. With the U.S. and its allies having on several occasions accused uh, Moscow of nuclear saber-rattling, President Vladimir Putin insists in March that at no point during the conflict has Russia considered using uh, such weapons around the same time. Kremlin's spokesperson Dmitry Peskov stressed that Russian nuclear doctrine envisages the use of weapons. It says in the use of weapons of, of destruction only if something threatens the existence of our country echoing a previous statement by the head of state. The official also described the deterrence of a farewell weapon. It says, uh, during this annual address to the uh, Federal Assembly in late February, Putin warned will be aggressors that the nuclear arsenal was in a state of complete readiness for guaranteed deployment. Earlier this month, the Russian leader ordered an exercise in the use of a tactical nuclear weapons in the southern military district, which borders Ukraine, according to the statement by the Foreign and Defense Ministry. The exercises were meant as a warning to the United States and its allies following the uh, Alex. Uh, Ale- uh, what you call it, a laxatory rhetoric from the West. Escalationatory, so I can slip a ton of words. Yeah, escalationatory rhetoric from the West. And this is, um, bring out the scriptures. Ecclesiastes 3 and verse 8, in a time of love, in a time of H-A-T-E, in a time of war, in a time of peace. And this is, a uh, book of Isaiah. Verse 17 Behold, I will stir up the Medes, which is the Russians. As you've seen previously, I read the news article of the uh, latest nuclear strike practice that Russia has did, sending that uh, warning to the Western countries and uh, the United States as well, too. It says, Behold, I will stir up the Medes against them, which shall not guard, shall not regard silver, and as for gold, they shall not delight in it. This is uh, Ezekiel. Ezekiel 38 verse 4 I will turn thee back and put hooks into thy jaws and I will bring thee forth in all thy armies horse and horsemen all of them uh, sort with all sorts of armor even a great company of bucklers and shields and all them having swords right so the heavenly father is going to put that hooks and back to the jaws of Russia to be in a war like man said as we've been seeing the uh, Russian Ukraine situation been heating up and as we've been seeing Belarus and Russia been doing nuclear strikes nuclear training you know, sending that war, uh, 